actually really excited. We're going to do a new song this morning called God So Love, which we really love. Um, it's really simple. I just want to show you the chorus actually really quick, if I could. Um, it goes like this. For God so loved the world that he gave us, his one and only son to save us, whoever believes in him will live forever. And then it says the power of hell. You guys can try it out. It goes, the power of hell forever defeated.
God, we're here to lean in to meet with you. Would you help us to meet with you, God? How great the chasm that lay between us. How high the mountain I could not climb. In desperation, I turned to heaven and spoke your name into the night. Then through the darkness, your loving kindness tore through the shadows of my soul. Is finished, the end is written, and Jesus Christ, my living Who could imagine so great a mercy? Oh, what heart could fathom such boundless grace? of ages step down from glory to wear my sin and bear my shame the cross has spoken I am forgiven oh the king of kings calls me his own beautiful savior Yours forever, and Jesus Christ, my living hope. So, hallelujah, praise the one who set me free. Hallelujah, death has lost its grip on me. You have broken every chain. There's salvation in your name, Jesus Christ, my living hope. It came on a Then came the morning that sealed the promise. when I'm just like anxious or restless and um, sometimes I just need to come before God and I just need to, to, to rest in his presence. I just need to be still because life moves so fast and weeks are so busy and our days are so full of distraction that it's nice to come to a place like this and just go, okay, God, I'm going to be still right now before you. And would you help me, God, to draw near to you, to quiet my mind, to quiet my heart, and just be still and to hear from you God and to receive what you have for me to be present in your presence so Lord you help us to do that now in Jesus name Christ 
is the shore and steady anchor in the fury of the storm. When the winds of down blow through me and my sails have all been torn, in the suffering, in the sorrow, when my seeking hopes of you, I will hold fast to the anchor, it shall never be and in our prayers for the things that we see in his word. And we use this as an opportunity also to come and just lay things at his feet. So let me read to you. This is Revelation 21, one through six. It says, then I saw a new heaven and a new earth. For the first heaven and the first earth had passed away and there is no longer any sea. Saw the holy city, the new Jerusalem, coming down out of heaven from God, prepared as a bride, beautifully dressed for her husband, and I heard a loud voice from the throne saying, look, God's dwelling place is now among the people and he will dwell with them. They will be his people and God himself will be with them and be their God. He'll wipe every tear from their eyes. There will be no more death or mourning or crying or pain for the old order of things has passed away. He who was seated on the throne said, I'm making everything new. Then he said, write this down for these words are trustworthy and true. He said to me, it is done. I am the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. To the thirsty, I will give water without cost from the spring of the water of life. Heavenly Father, we look forward to that time, that day. And while we stand here today, Lord, we receive from you the, the power and life that you give us now. And we ask that you'd help us just to stand on your word, to stand firm on your word, Lord, in spite of circumstances, in spite of 
world events that we would be people who stand firm in our trust of you, in our worship of you. And Lord, that you would hold us fast. You'd be the anchor that holds us, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. I've carried a burden for too long on my own. I wasn't created to bear it alone. I hear your invitation to let it all go. I see it now, laying it down. I know that I need you. Run to the Father, fall in grace. I'm done with the hiding, the reason to wait. My heart needs a surgeon, my soul needs a friend. So run to the Father.
um, as we heard in your word today, that even your anger is a, a statement of your deep love and of our value. And so, Lord, we praise you for that. Um, will we go out in your power and live for you? In Jesus' name, amen. So good worship with you guys. I hope you guys will stick around and enjoy each other. We also have some people who would love to pray with you if you want to pray with somebody. But don't rush off. Try to say hi to somebody. Hang out for a little bit.